Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're just joining me then hi, my name's Natasha and if you are returning then welcome back. So today is just a little video I thought I would vlog. I haven't done a vlog since my birthday last year and I really just feel like picking up the camera today and just showing you what I'm getting up to. Obviously the UK is in our third national lockdown so obviously I can't do much but I am just about to pop to Home Bargains so I'm going to go to Home Bargains. Um, I probably won't film in there because to be fair I, I, I'm not brave enough to film out yet. This is still all so new to me. Um, but I will show you what I get from Home Bargains in a little haul later on in this video. So if you do enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments if you like my kind of vlogs or any particular videos you like to see from me, do let me know. But I'm gonna go to Home Bargains now and I'll see you all a little bit later on. every time in the shop say hello to the YouTube channel you can talk though right. this is going on the internet no don't put him on there that's not right <laughs> he doesn't care my mum's in the back hiding so I've just been into home bargains let me take this off all my makeup's come up off on it look because the bloke at the counter chatting it was really nice though and uh, he thanked me for oh and everyone at the NHS for all our hard work um, so he's had someone in today from the ICU as well in there so we were talking about you know how strong and brave everyone is in the ICU but I must say I was very shocked actually in there because there were so many large groups of people in there like people bringing in their family members there was like parents and I know you can't really leave your kids at home but just there was big groups of people everywhere I was trying to dodge as many people as I could I got one little clip in the shop but not an awful lot because everyone was just everywhere and I just felt like I didn't want to draw any attention to myself so yeah I'll show you what I've got when I come back and um, when I get back home so stay tuned for the Home Bargains haul. So I've just got back from Home Bargains and I've literally cleaned everything that I bought because as I've said before in my other videos, I literally clean everything um, from the shops, whether it's a supermarket or an essential store or anything like that. And I have a little fluffy, well not a little, a big fluffy thing here called Mia. And she's so smart, I've bought her a toy. So I'm gonna show you that first because she knows there was a toy in that bag so mum's gonna give it to me it's this strawberry Oi, you can wait you can wait you can wait it's a strawberry go on then go on then there's a good girl she knew she saw it she's so intelligent we had to try and take it out of the bag and while she weren't looking kind of thing and uh, yeah she knew all along that there was a teddy in that bag for her so now I'm going to show you everything that I got in Home Bargains okay everyone so I'm going to show you now what I got from Home Bargains so I'm not going to show you in any kind of particular order I'm just going to pick things up so first things first is I got a couple of packets of false nails so I got these like really nice oval ones in like a sparkly pink colour. And I also got just your ordinary kind of French manicure kind of set. Those are just for like YouTube videos, like makeup videos, because my nails and cuticles are minging. I've spoken about it loads of times before. Um, I really do suffer with dry cracked cuticles. Ooh, that was quite tongue twister. Um, so yeah I've got those and I've got all like my oils and stuff that I use anyway stocked up on a couple of anti back wipes now I know they're not very environmentally friendly however um, we all use these as I've said like many a times to wipe over shopping wipe over the bags that we use 
some people might think that's a little bit OTT, but at the end of the day, with this virus, it could be living on any kind of service. And these were like 59p each, I think. I have got my receipt here, so let me just look. Yeah, they were 59p each. I picked up for myself a new battery operated toothbrush and this one's got like the round head i've got one of the i think it's oral b um toothbrushes the battery ones um you can't change the batteries on that one or the heads um but it's quite it's just like a normal long brush that you'd have on an ordinary toothbrush but this one is round and that's what i really need to get around all of my teeth and around my braces the one thing i'm gutted about is that in ordinary shops or supermarkets i just can't find the interdental toothbrushes now not the little flossers that you can get in all different like um whips but just like it's like a long tiny little toothbrush that really gets in and around your braces so i used to be able to get them in savers but i don't have a savers where i live so I might have to order some online and I'm not going to get them in the orthodontist because they charge the earth and I'm not paying more than if I can get it cheaper elsewhere. So I've got that and you can change the batteries with it. Speaking of toothbrushes, also got these um, to try whenever I need um, to change my toothbrush over. Um, it's the Humble Company. Um, they are plant-based materials, two-pack um, toothbrushes, vegan uh so yeah i think <clears throat> it's all been made from plant-based materials composition is a mix of 70 percent cornstarch and 30 percent pp dentist approved 100 percent recyclable so yeah i saw those these are about 199 and my other toothbrush i think it was 299 Yes, my spin toothbrush was $2.99 and these were $1.99. Next is just, you know, very essential. Just a couple of packets of sanitary towels. Always normally get these ones. This was the last packet in there. And then I saw the other ones that they do. And these are the same as these, but they're not as long as these ones. So um, this one's for a regular flow. <laughs> and this one's for a heavy flow. Now these are my ride or die. Um... But these i'm going to try those out on lighter days uh, it might be a bit too much but at the end of the day us women we go through periods periods are natural so yeah 89p each i think for those when i was near that um kind of section that's where they have like the olivia hale range and all the makeup and stuff this eyeshadow palette was 99p i couldn't get over the price just look at all the shades the colours, especially the greens, really drew my attention. So I think when I do... Um, oh, it's by Wet n Wild. That is really good. I didn't even know that was by Wet n Wild in the shop. But I don't know if you can see there. It's kind of like on the glass. It says Wet n Wild. Uh, it does actually say on the back, but I didn't actually look at the back in the shop. But um, yeah, 99p for that. It does come with like the little eyeshadow brush and like the little sponge that you'd normally get in an eyeshadow palette and it tells you um so what's for the eyelid for the brow bone for the crease and then the definer so i really like that it reminds me of the beauty babe palettes that you can get where it tells you what stages and what colors to put where on your lids so that is going to be coming up um in an upcoming video so yeah super excited to try that out also got some of these for 99p these were like the cheapest ones um some reusable drinking straws it comes with the little cleaning brush in there i don't know if you can see that there um i got them in the silver instead of the gold i just prefer silver over gold um they're stainless steel eco-friendly um yeah 99p can't wait to have these with iced coffees when it gets a little bit Walmart although having said that I have been craving an iced caramel soya latte that's like my go-to iced coffee um, my go-to coffee is a soya latte sometimes I'll have caramel but I don't know what it is but I think caramel tastes so much better in an iced coffee um, so yeah can't wait to try those out then an absolute staple in our family kitchen so when mum makes her amazing curries um, we like to cook up well prepare some of this basically it's the tar tar dal um, a mix rich of lentils cooked with onions garlic and a whole red chili this stuff is sensational it goes really nicely alongside a curry as well it's quite healthy actually because of the lentils 
um but yeah this this was actually very hard to find a few months ago in home bargains i'd go in like well me or my mum would go in every week when they had a delivery and see if this was delivered and it would just sell out so quickly but honestly we love this so much so it's the indie grand um yeah chef selection tard kadal i'd highly recommend it when you have a curry night at home if you're making your own curries it's absolutely delish and also that brand i love their mango chutney it is out of this world like i don't think i could go back to any other kind of man mango chutney so yeah that is another thing got this variety pack of chocolate for us to share so i thought that would be nice i think this was 99p you know let me just double check so i don't want to tell you the wrong price so are we oh, it was 1.99 my bad uh, not 99p but it's good because you've got so many big brands in here so you've got rollo aero munchies toffee crisp kit kat chunky and the yorkie original for 1.99 so that's great then for my dad i think these were 99p as well i got him some pitted dates he loves anything like any kind of like nuts dried fruit but i really thought i'd get him these they look super fresh and yummy might even try one myself i've had dates in like natural bars where you can taste the whole date but i might just try one on its own and see how i like it so those are for my dad and then for mia along with her teddy i found this pet brush now this was super value for money it was less than a pound it's dual sided so it's a pet grooming brush. Um, I would have liked a bigger one, but this is the only one they had. So it's got that really nice kind of bit here, which really gets all the dead fur out. And then that brush, which I think just gets any kind of like knots or matting out. Um, I don't know if you know, but German Shepherds do have two layers of like fur and she is a long haired German Shepherd. So you can imagine the molt, <laughs> but um, we try and keep on top of it. And I just feel like this is gonna get rid of all her like dead fur that needs to come out and i love it when i brush her because as soon as i brush her she just looks like a new dog and her coat's super shiny so i got her that this was let's just double check and see how much it was it was 79p absolute bargain i don't know how much this would be in pets at home but i reckon it'd be a lot more than 79p so yeah glad i got that and just to let you know the tarka dal was i believe 79p uh let's have a look yeah so the the dal was uh 79p as well then uh i got these for my mum because she absolutely loves these so it's the fiber one um chocolate popcorn bars so these were 99p per box so got her two boxes there so yeah mum loves those and they're not always in stock so she was very happy when she saw that i managed to purchase those um and then the last food items was i got a pot of each flavor basically of the pot noodles 60p each so chicken and mushroom beef and tomato and then the original curry flavor and what i love about these is that the the meatiness in them is actually vegetarian so that's vegetarian that's vegetarian and that's vegetarian now i must say i was influenced by um laura meacham's uh, youtube video she bought this and apparently she gets a lot of nice comments on it so i thought why not let's try it out oh, it smells like a giant marshmallow with like a really nice sweetie kind of like really nice caramely scent to it so it's just a hand wash it's the vanilla and macadamia cocoon hand wash by Creighton's, made in england um so yeah that was 99p i needed to get some uh, bubble bath and again this is the one laura purchased and to be fair i was drawn to this myself so it's the calming bath soak it's moonlit skies and white cashmere uh this was also 99p i think yes 99p oh, that is my scent that is definitely my scent and um i don't know if you would have seen i don't know if i've shown you guys but in my last my last time i went to home bargains i purchased some epsom salts um to calm me down so they're gonna pair nicely with these um actually i'll just show you those right now so it's the west lab ones um the sleep ones they're vegan and 
they are epsom and dead sea salts with lavender and jasmine now i have filled up my little um jewels pot that i used to have salts in so i can reuse it um so yeah that and that together is going to make a really lovely calming sensational bubble bath so yeah looking forward to having a nice bath with those then I need to get myself a new shampoo and conditioner and I've wanted to try this for ages because I've heard so many great things about it. Now I normally use the L'Oreal Dream Lengths which is really really good but I have oily roots and dry ends and this is what this is for. So this is the LV L'Oreal Paris Extraordinary Clay. So it's for yeah oily roots and dry ends so that is the shampoo. And that is the conditioner. These were one ninety nine each, which I think is quite good because I think in supermarkets or any other places they would be a lot more expensive. Second to last thing, Mum needed some colour catchers. Now this is by Dylon, um, so we always get the Dylon brand. Now these were three fifty, and they're ordinary box. It says twenty four plus twelve on there. I thought that was better better when I first looked at the two, but then I realised. This actually has 60 sheets in it and the other one, 24 plus 12, 36 for exactly the same price. They were both 350. I checked the label. So 350 for 60 sheets, that's going to be great. One in each wash, so that's going to be 60 washes. So yeah, um, chuff with that. I thought that was quite a good deal. And then the last thing to show you are these glasses that I got for 99p each. Now, I kind of bought them for when on the property ladder but i can also use them now if i want to it's these beautiful glasses i can't believe they were 99p and when i went to the um counter to pay the man in there did say that they've got like a marilyn monroe range in like the gift section i didn't see them um, but yeah as i said 99p and the detailing on these glasses is stunning so i have got two of those just to start off with if i go back and see them again i might pick up another two so i've got four which is like a nice amount i think but for now i just picked up two so yeah they feel really weighty really thick around the bottom but yeah stunning glass for 99p so that was everything from Home Bargains that I picked up today. I keep thinking it's a Saturday today, but it's not, it's Friday. It's because I've got a day off work. I'm off tomorrow as well, so I'm probably gonna, I'm probably gonna vlog a little bit tomorrow as well. Um, it might be a long video, I hope not. But yeah, so whenever I do something next, I will check in with you. Oh, the lighting is not good. Um, just got changed into my um, workout attire uh let me show you in the mirror actually so wearing my plt sport leggings um with the, the white stripe just a sports bra that i've had from primark um so yeah if you followed not followed if you watched my previous um youtube video about rwl that is the fitness uh, platform that i am using so i'm going to I'm going to go and do a workout now, um, and then I've got meat-free burgers for dinner. Um, I want to have just one, because I need to try and cut down on my portion sizes. I don't have burger buns, so that's healthier. So I'm having just the meat-free burgers on their own. I'm thinking of maybe having an egg on one of them, and then just a few chips maybe to go with it. Um, if we've got any salad, a bit of salad on the burgers as well. But yeah, so that's what I'm having for tea tonight. But does anyone else do this? So in the morning when you get up, you think, right, I've got to change my bed sheets today. So you strip your bed and you think, I'll let the, the bed air throughout the whole day and I'll come and do it later. And then you come back up to your room for whatever reason. Mine was to get changed into my workout outfit. And you realise that you forgot to do it so that is going to be a mammoth task later on this is some really nice cotton bedding it does look a little bit christmasy but it is super soft and warm and that is just what i need in my life right now we are in february so it's not 
too Christmassy, you know. And then obviously I have my lovely teddy blanket to go on the top. Um, so yeah, I'll change that later on. But now let's work out. So I just finished my workout. It was um, like cardio with strength training. Um, so yeah, I've just achieved my exercise goal. I'm quite sweaty. Probably sweat all my makeup off. I've got to remember to scrub my face tonight, get my makeup off so it doesn't sit in my pores. But yeah, I used 3 kg weights just for reference throughout. It's quite challenging. I'm trying to flex and see if I got any muscle coming. But um yeah, really, really enjoyed my workout. So I'm gonna have my dinner soon. So yeah, looking forward to having my dinner. So here's my dinner. I've got the Richmond meat free burgers um, with a nice fried egg on the top. My mum always makes fried eggs perfect. And I've got some skinny fries. I'm going to have some ketchup with it. And I've got some, I think it's Pepsi Zero with some ice. So I'm going to tuck into this. Looks absolutely delish and there's plenty of protein there for after my workout. So I just got out of the shower. As you can see, my beautiful friends have made an appearance. Um, I did scrub my face with a facial cleanser in the shower. But I'm just going to go over the rest of my face with my micellar water. Just to get any excess makeup off. And then I'm probably going to use my jade roller and some vitamin C serum. Right, you're currently balancing on um, my body shop gift set that I got for Christmas and my lateral flow testing kit box. Because my tripod doesn't extend, I need to invest in a big tripod and not just this one. This one's great. This um, this is the one that Jessica Jane uses. She's like my favourite YouTuber. I love her vlogs. She did actually recommend this one to me. It's about £20 off Amazon. Um, it's so sturdy it's the manfrotto tripod so yes yeah, so i've just taken it off to show you this part of the video so this is my vitamin c serum this was from asda it was two pounds 25 to be exact and what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna put some of the serum on my face i don't know if you can see it there so put a bit there and then I'm going to just slowly roll in that direction. It's going to help with the blood flow around the face. Honestly, jade rollers are so cold, but it's so refreshing on the skin. Up the nose and then up the forehead. And I'll just do this. And honestly, it's just so relaxing. You're probably not meant to go over your eye sockets, but I do just love the feeling and I'll just do it I don't know I suppose you could go back and forth that's probably the idea of it but I don't know I just like to go in one direction and just push everything that way like when you moisturize with your hands you push everything back so that's what I'm doing with the jade roller my cheeks are looking very red on camera um, so I've just cleansed my skin with my micellar water and now I'm just doing this step to make sure the vitamin C gets locked into the skin. Honestly though, for £2.25 it's great. And I have used the um, moisturiser for this and honestly, it's one of the best moisturisers ever, ever. It is like up there with the body shop. Um, so that's what I use. If I don't use that one, I normally use this. I got this out of my Holland and Barrett... Um, christmas beauty advent calendar or skincare advent calendar um it's by the brand true true skincare and it's rose hip and rosemary facial oil so before i purchased the vitamin c one i used that um which is really nice but this vitamin c really does make my skin feel alive 
So once I've done that and I've kind of let it sink into the skin, I'm just going to take my number seven advanced night cream and massage this into my skin. It's quite thick, but it's a nice thick, if that makes sense. It's not cloggy or extremely pasty. Um, and I just rub this all around, all around my skin and then under on my multiple chins and down my neck as well. I don't put this on every night, which I should really, but I do use my jade roller most nights. Um, so yeah. So that was my little skincare routine. My skin feels really refreshed right now. So now what I've got to do, you can see behind me, got to put my fresh bed sheets on it's got to be done otherwise I'm not going to end up doing it and I do not want to sleep in a bed that's not been made up so now to do that I think I'm actually oh wow I look red I look really red I think I'm gonna start investing in king size fitted sheets because double sheets don't really fit double beds well like super tight it doesn't come all the way down I hate it it's one of the worst things and I hate stretching material I don't know it's really random it just makes my teeth go funny I absolutely absolutely hate it but we continue <laughs> So that is my bed made, oh my god, it's Mia barking. Anytime like a big lorry or a motorcyclist goes past, she goes absolutely crazy. Um, but yeah, I've made my bed, here it is. I've just left it open like that so it airs out, like the bottom sheet airs out nicely. So yeah, it's super soft, cannot wait to get in this tonight, freshly showered, done my skincare, fresh PJs on. Yeah, can't wait for bed tonight.
I went to Sainsbury's before the dog walk, so I'm just going to quickly show you what we got. So we got some um, wholemeal sourdough. Uh, got some crumble mix. Mum loves this to make crumbles with. Uh, this was the last one. It's the Plant Pioneers No Chicken Samosas. I love these um, during Veganuary. These are so tasty. Yeah, so they were the last one. So I feel very lucky to get my hands on um, a pack of those. Got myself some salmon fillets for in... Uh, well, probably for Monday because that's when it, they need to be used by. Um, have that for dinner on Monday. Got some corn mints for bolognese. This is well good. This was only about 80p and the bigger one was a pound. But just got this one. It's just tomato ketchup. Tin of ambrosia with Santa on it. Even though it's February. <laughs> some really nice um, strawberries. Look at the size of those. My favourite ever oven chips. It's the McCain naked ones. Again these are what I found doing Veganuary. They're the best chips. They cook up so nicely. Um, Mum needed some more decaf tea. Got 12 British free range eggs and four Mia. Um, the winner lot shapes and then the small biscuit bones, the little brown and black ones. So yeah, that's everything we got from Sainsbury's. Oh, and Dad got a paper as well because he can't live without his paper. Hi everyone, so I am just chilling now, I have been for a little while, I need to do a workout later on before my dinner, um, but I've just made myself a soya latte and mum made um, some little kind of like apple turnover roll things, so I'm going to have one of those with my coffee, watch some YouTube, um, So yeah, I've got to do a workout later on and then I'm going to have my dinner. Probably going to be, I've got some vegan duck. Well, obviously it's not duck, but it's vegan alternative. Um, I'm going to have some of the Mayflower curry sauce over it with some rice. Um, that is a recipe that Hazel, um, Hazel Wood, a YouTuber that I like watching, she has that regularly. Um, well, not regularly, but she's had it and it looks really nice. So... Yeah, I'm going to have that for my dinner, but I'm probably going to end this vlog here, otherwise it's just going to be really super long. But yeah, I really, really hope you enjoyed this vlog and the home bargains haul and meeting my dog Mia. If you did, please give the video a huge thumbs up hit the subscribe button and the post notification bell so you get notified every time I upload. And I'll see you all again soon with a brand new video. Bye everyone.